Hey, this is Alec Kermit. I'm making this uh, quick video because I really need your guys' help with um, recording. Um, I need some advice. I'm having a ton of trouble um, with the EasyCap and the Dazzle with Windows 7. Originally, I was using the EasyCap DC60 with Windows XP, and aside from a few weird quirks that I had to learn to adjust to, um, it really worked great. You can see my older videos, they have great quality. It's got this video and the audio worked fine, it's synced. It kind of works as its own splitter as well. Um, and it was really not a big pain. And then I w moved to Windows 7 and I tried uh, using this. And I tried, I think, two or three different workaround methods to get this work to work with Windows 7 64-bit. And I either got uh, no results at all, like no video at all, or I got video, um, only composite video and no audio and when I like pulled this thing out of the computer my computer would crash <clears throat> so I mean this is like the option I'm gonna have to fall back to at the moment is to just go with the composite video if I can get that working again and then do like a, a line in or something for the sound anyway I really don't want to do that so hopefully that's out so what I did um, when this wasn't working well, I bought a uh, Dazzle, DC, DVC 100 or whatever you call it. Um, and I heard a lot of good things about this. It's just easy to use and there is support for Windows 7 and stuff. So I got this set up and once again having tons of trouble. Um, the video and stuff, you know, the slots work. I'm getting video. But the problem is with uh, the quality and the recording. The quality, I mean, before I've even, like, compressed it or encoded it or whatever, when it's just on screen showing me the video input, it looks like crap. It looks like half of the definition I used to get with the EasyCap DC60. Um, you, could, you can see if you watch my um, Chameleon Twist 2 uh, speedrun on Swirless's channel, um, you can see that it just looks really pixelated and grainy and it's all, all the definition is not there. Um, so that's one issue. First of all, the quality just sucks. Um, issue number two is uh, the recording. When I first tried to use this thing with the default settings where it created uh, .vobs, which are DVD files, um, and you know every so often, I think like every five minutes, it splits the files, so you end up with multiple files, and then you just have to piece them together. It's not a big deal. but um, with that method, for some reason, when the VOBs split, when it changed to another file, it glitched the video. When I put them together, there would be like a quick jump. There would be, I would say, maybe half a second of video loss. Um, maybe a little bit of a sound glitch as well. So dot .VOBs did not work, so I moved on to uncompressed AVI. And that turned out to where the video constantly like sped up and slowed down while the audio stayed synced synced so it completely runs the video when I try to record in AVI with this thing. So then I moved to MPEG-2 trying to record um, compressed MPEG-2 from this and that's what you see um, that's what my Chameleon Twist 2 run on Sorless's channel is and the quality is not great as you can see and um, the frame rate of the video constantly drops in busy areas of games and stuff when there's a lot going on on screen the frame rate drops. So I am just hitting one wall after another with this crap and I'm really I really just need advice what should I get? What is going to work for me with Windows 7 to where I'm gonna get good quality like I got with my easy cap and I'm gonna be able to record audio as well and just without all this stupid hassle I mean there has to be something with around the eighty dollar price range or less I'm willing to go about that high. I'm not. I'm not dropping 150 bucks on an HD PVR. It's ridiculous. So anyway, if you have any advice for me, please leave a comment or PM me. Um, I'm just having so much trouble with this stuff. I want to start recording videos again. I want to continue my Agent Under Fire speed run. Maybe continue Reverse Dungeon Order and Legend of Zelda. But I just can't do it with this current setup. It's it's too frustrating.